large cargo containers used for storage are stirring up some controversy because people are keeping them on their property. It's up for debate whether they're eyesores or a good way for homeowners to recycle them. It's become an issue in Muscatine. Now, here's one property there with an old cargo container being used for storage. Muscatine City Council could change the rules when it comes to having them in residential neighborhoods. It's expected to go to City Council in a couple of weeks. Fox 18's Blake Hornstein reports a man who has these containers thinks he's being targeted by the city. William Havel moved to this property on 67th Avenue in West Muscatine not too long ago. A quiet neighborhood with nice sized yards. I have my lawn and garden equipment. Plenty of room to enjoy the outdoors. I have my barbecue equipment and miscellaneous tools that don't need to be in the garage. So William's solution, old shipping containers. They're going to hold up a lot longer. He once had three. Now he's down to one, and he's worried city leaders are going to take that from him. Nadine Brocker brought up the fact that she wanted these out of here and called me out. She doesn't want any of them to be left in town at all because she considers them to be unsightly. Nadine Brockert is a city council member. She told us the containers often don't match the house color and are full of stickers that are unsightly. And Muscatine's mayor also told us he's concerned about the look of the containers in neighborhoods. Havel does not agree. They're going to look better, they're not going to rust out, and everybody's going to have enough room to put their stuff inside and out, not being sitting out in the yard looking at. Reporting for Fox 18 News, I'm Blake Hornstein. Muscatine City staff hasn't released the exact language of the proposal yet. The mayor tells Fox 18 News it will be ready before the city council meeting on April 21st. Wasa County is